Chapter 591, Enemies The originally tense atmosphere in the rock fragment ground suddenly relaxed after the Great Way Empire left in a somewhat dejected manner. Numerous unique gazes continuously swept over Emo Ling's group. Immediately, they released a soft sigh. It was unexpected that these three fellows, who looked like ordinary individuals, were actually related with this this group of abnormal people that were renowned across this core region. This involuntarily caused them to secretly feel relieved. It was fortunate that they did not add insult to injury earlier. Otherwise, it was likely that their fate would not be any better than Lee Kun's group. Ground Evil Alliance, for Great Demon Sex, Lin Dong was too lazy to be bothered about the surrounding gazes. His mouth quietly repeated these words, which Chen Jun had mumbled earlier. Looks like it should be another treasure trove. However, from its name, it seems like they are arch enemies with the Tian Gang Alliance. They might have even engaged in life and death battles back then. Little Martin laughed. That is of no concern to me. Lin Dong frowned and said. Hee hee, at times, one must naturally bear some of the responsibility of the inheritance that one obtained. Little Martin laughed heartlessly. Ching Ji never mentioned this to me. Lin Dong helplessly shook his head. Ching Ji never mentioned that he had to deal with the ground evil alliance when he had received his inheritance. Lin Dong, you do need to be careful about the ground evil alliance. M. O. Ling, who was standing behind Lin Dong suddenly said. Hey. Lin Dong turned his head in surprised and stared at M. O. Ling, whose expression was a lot more grave. Based on what I know, the inheritance of the Ground Evil Alliance four great demon sects have landed in the hands of four extremely powerful super sects. Moreover, the inheritance that they have obtained are a little unique. It requires the fresh blood of the four who have obtained the inheritance of the four great mysterious sects. Only then will it be fully activated. M. O. Ling said. Oh. Lin Dong's eyes became focused. Clearly. He did not expect that the inheritance of the Ground Evil Alliance would actually be this unique. It seems like the grudge between the Ground Evil Alliance and the Tian Gang Alliance must be quite a huge one. Even they, their inheritors, must participate in this feud. You have obtained two of the four great mysterious sects inheritance, while the other two landed into the hands of Yan Sen and Lu Bai. Earlier, we heard that they had already exchanged blows with those super empires who had obtained the inheritance of the Ground Evil Alliance, even before they reached the core region, M. O. Ling said. Even Lu Bai and Yan Sen are targeted by them. Lin Dong narrowed his eyes. It seems that this Ground Evil sect is truly targeting them with ill intent. Your reputation has already spread across this core region. It looks like these fellows will come and look for you soon. Little Martin smilingly said. They can come if they want. We also need quite a lot of Nirvana seals in order to enter that Nirvana Golden Ranking. If they wish to deliver themselves to us, I will be happy to accept them. Lin Dong smiled. He did not feel the slightest fear. Although he did not like trouble, he was not afraid of it as well. With his current fighting strength, he would stand quite a high chance of victory even when facing those experts at the peak of the Four Yuan Nirvana stage. Moreover, Little Flame, Little Martin and Suro also possessed powerful fighting abilities. Hence, he was not afraid even if they had to clash head-on with a super empire. Just what are these four great demon sects? Lin Dong paused for a moment before suddenly asking. The four great demon sects are named after fearsome beasts from ancient times. They are Yu Wu, Dozong, Kyanki, Zuyin, and these inheritances are all extraordinary. Furthermore, thanks to the foundation of a super empire, it is sufficient to allow their leaders to possess the qualification to attempt to enter the Nirvana Golden Ranking. M. O. Ling spoke solemnly. Fearsome beasts from ancient times, Hui. Lin Dong nodded slightly. It did have a similar naming fashion as the four great mysterious sects. One is upright while the other is nefarious. No wonder they oppose each other. That's right, M. O. Ling, this is my brother Lin Diao, Lin Dong suddenly appeared to have suddenly recalled something and introduced both parties. 
Emo Ling hurriedly cupped his hands together upon hearing this. His appearance was actually quite handsome and there was even a little feminine aura to him. However, if he was to compare with little Martin's demonically handsome appearance, the latter was clearly on a completely different level. If this was a comparison between two ladies, both would indeed be pleasing to the eye. However, if it was between two men, one need not even mention how embarrassing it was. However, Emma Ling did not underestimate Little Martin just because of the latter's appearance. After witnessed Little Flame's frightening strength, he gained a respectful mentality towards all of these people who had suddenly appeared beside Lin Dong. Moreover, he was able to vaguely sense that this handsome young man, who had yet to attack, was likely a terrifying character. There is no need to be courteous. We can be considered as friends. Little Martin smiled. The words that he subsequently uttered caused Emma Ling and the two others to be at a loss. However, Little Martin did not give an explanation. After all, he had hid himself within Lin Dong's body and Emma Ling's group was naturally unaware of his existence. Lin Dong subsequently introduced So Kui and Su Ro. After which, both parties got to know each other a little before they quickly became familiar with each other. That's right, there is something else. While both parties were becoming familiar with each other, Emma Ling suddenly looked towards Lin Dong and spoke with a much more solemn expression in his eyes, We met Lin Lang Tian. Lin Lang Tian. Lin Dong's eyes suddenly shrunk. That fellow is still alive hey. A good guy has a short life while a scourge survives for a thousand years. This saying is indeed true. It is unexpected that this lad actually possessed such a hearty life. Little Martin clicked his mouth and said. Emma Ling's group was aware of the deep grudge between Lin Dong and Lin Lang Tian. Therefore, they were not shocked by his reaction. After musing for a moment, Emma Ling continued, However, that fellow is a little strange and he is a little different from before. When we saw him, he saw us as well. However, his eyes were staring at us in a somewhat foreign manner. Lin Dong knitted his brows slightly. Just what had happened to Lin Lang Tian? Regardless, it did not appear to be good news for him. Of course, despite this unfamiliarity, that fellow's strength had become extremely terrifying, Du Yun by the side continued. We saw him kill an expert who had stepped into the Four Yuan Nirvana stage and snatch the other party's Nirvana seal. Lin Dong's eyes congelated. When he was at the ancient treasure trove back then, Lin Liang Tian's strength was at most at two Yuan Nirvana stage. It was unexpected that his strength had actually advanced to such a shocking level within a short few months. It seemed like it must be due to other circumstances. There are more and more enemies. Lin Dong gently flicked his five fingers. Sharp wind lingered over the tip of his fingers. His face did not reveal the slightest anxiety or fear. Instead, it was filled with some heat. This was the Hundred Empire War and it would involuntarily cause one's blood boil. Let's go. Head to the Hundred Empire Mountain. Since we have finally reached here, we must at least witness the final battleground. I really wish to exchange blows with those demon-like geniuses from the various large empires in the eastern Qian region. Lin Dong raised his head and smiled. After which, he ceased uttering any other words. He waved his hand and his body took the lead to rush out. Little Martin, Little Flame and the rest followed closely behind him. Emma Ling and the two others looked at Lin Dong's back. The fresh blood within their bodies began to show vague signs of boiling. Being members of the Great Yan Empire, they similar felt pride when they saw Lin Dong's accomplishments. When news from the ancient battlefield was transmitted back to the Great Yan Empire, the entire empire the imperial family and the various clans and sects would be shaken because of all his actions. That fellow would perhaps become the most dazzling existence within this ancient battlefield. This was an empty forest. A group of people was seated deep within this forest. Although no unusual sound was emitted from it, the cold and ferocious aura that was faintly being emitted caused the atmosphere in this place to show signs of solidifying. Swoosh. A ray of light suddenly rushed over from the distance amidst this silence. After which, it was grabbed by a figure within that group. 
It was actually a voice transmitting jade plate. That person listened to the voice within the jade plate. After which, he suddenly raised his head and looked towards the middle of the forest. There was a figure who was seated cross-legged like a demon king there. Waves after waves of shocking hot fire chi continued to be emitted from within his body. Chief, there is news about Lin Dong's group. That demon god-like figure finally opened his tightly shut eyes slowly upon hearing this loud laughter. His entire body was covered by a fire chi, vaguely forming a large beast with an ape-like body, white head and red legs. A fearsome beast from the ancient times, Zuyin. Has he finally appeared? Some murderous intent slowly surged into the pair of fiery red eyes under the flame. He immediately stood up. With a flash of his body, he had appeared in the distant large tree. Let's go, only by killing him, can I receive the true inheritance of the Zuyin sect. Upon hearing the misty voice that resounded across the forest, a killing desire also suddenly surged up the eyes of the many people below. The sound of rushing wind appeared as they whizzed out. Crack. A clear bone cracking sound suddenly appeared. At the same time, an expert with Yuan power ripples over his body that was not weaker to that of the peak of a three Yuan Nirvana stage expert, slowly collapsed. Fresh blood seeped out from his head that was cracked apart. Finally, he slumped onto the ground. There seemed to be a terror that could not be removed within that pair of eyes. Bang. A green-clothed human figure beside this corpse kicked it apart. After which, he extended his tongue and licked the fresh blood and brains on his hand. A sharp and strange voice was emitted from his mouth. Lin Dong, the current me will likely cause you to be wary, he he. He slowly raised his head before his eyes turned towards a certain direction. That handsome face currently possessed a sinister and distortion like that of a stern ghost. He was actually Lin Lang Tian. Chapter 592, Knocking on Their Door Lin Dong's group continued to hurry towards the Hundred Empire Mountain at the center region without rest after leaving the Rock Fragment area, which was their temporary resting point. Currently, all the people within this region were doing their best to reach the final battlefield. This journey went on for an entire day and things were not too calm during this journey. After all, the core region had currently been turned into a pot to breed poisonous bugs and since Lin Dong's group were also part of the bugs, they were unable to escape from the cruel competition. Therefore, even if they did not take the initiative to attack, there would still be quite a number of empires who would be eyeing their Nirvana seals. Lin Dong did not pity those fellows, whose logic had been overshadowed by greed. Other than a few cunning individuals who escaped during the chaos, most of the people ended up suffering a loss after failing to steal. Instead, they had to surrender their Nirvana seals. After absorbing their Nirvana seals, the color of their heavenly grade Nirvana seals of Lin Dong Trio turned even brighter gold. Even Sir Rose Nirvana seal directly rose to heavenly grade. In this way, their group had four heavenly grade Nirvana seals. If word of this was to spread, it would end up attracting many jealous stares. So Kui, Emo Ling, and the two others had also absorbed quite a number of Nirvana seals that were delivered to them. Although their Nirvana seals did not advance to the heavenly grade, there was also a faint golden light flowing within their Nirvana seal. Clearly, they had reached the peak of the earth grade Nirvana seals. At this rate, it was not be impossible for them to upgrade their seals. Lin Dong's group rushed towards the Hundred Empire Mountain like a thunderbolt with quite a few interlude along the way. However, they enjoyed quite a bountiful reward. As they headed deeper into the forest, the number of individuals who took the initiative to attack them greatly decreased. After all, the Hundred Empire War had quite a brutal elimination system. Those who could pass through the many gazes of ill intent and enter this deep region would definitely possess outstanding ability and judgment. Hence, some people were clearly aware of who they should offend, and who they should not offend. Therefore, that kind of provocation was reduced greatly towards the end. However, this left Lin Dong's group feeling unsatisfied. After all, they wanted to reach the Nirvana Golden Ranking and that would require them to absorb even more Nirvana Seals. However, 
Lin Dong's group did feel a lot more relaxed since no one came to provoke them. When the second night gradually approached, they had already completely entered the deep regions of the core area. At this rate, it was likely that they would be able to reach that final battleground, the Hundred Empire Mountain, in no time. The night covered the entire land and Lin Dong's group came to a stop. The nights in the core region was even wilder and more violent compared to the nights in other parts of the ancient battlefield. Although Lin Dong was not afraid, Emma Ling, So Kui and the others could not ignore it. Of course, the most important reason was because Little Flame appeared to be showing signs of breaking through. Little Flame had already reached the peak of three Yuan Nirvana stage back in the ancient treasure trove. He had gained quite a lot after experiencing numerous bloody battles. Additionally, his body possessed a kind of mutated constitution and the bloodline of the Heavenly Devil Tiger tribe. Hence, he would be able to obtain twice the result with half the effort when he trained. In fact, his training progress even caused Lin Dong to feel a little involuntarily surprised. Their group landed on the top of a mountain. Little Flame did not say any unnecessary words after they landed. He directly sat down with his legs crossed. Waves after waves of powerful Yuan power began to spread apart in front of the shocked gazes of Emma Ling's group. Is he about to undergo the fourth Nirvana tribulation? So Kuei's face was filled with envy. Typically speaking, only those leaders of the super sex could reach this level within the core region at this moment. Lin Dong's face was full of smiles when he saw this scene. If Little Flame was able to successfully survive the fourth Nirvana tribulation, his strength was bound to soar. With his powerful demonic beast constitution, it was likely that he would even be able to fight against a 5 Yuan Nirvana stage expert if he was to go all out. Typically speaking, those experts in this core region who had stepped into the 5 Yuan Nirvana stage, were basically the kind of abnormal beings that had already charged into the Nirvana Golden Ranking. It should not be long before you will also be able to attempt the fourth Nirvana Tribulation. Standing beside him, Little Martyrn laughed as he spoke. Currently, Lin Dong's group had plenty of Nirvana pills since they sold three crossing disaster pills back at Wangxiang City. Hence, they did not need to worry about running out of Nirvana pills during their training. This was also one of the important reason why Little Flame was able to show traces of breaking through this soon. Lin Dong smiled but he did not deny it. He could similarly sense the surging Yuan power within his body. However, he did not take the initiative to push it. This kind of breakthrough must come naturally in order for it to be the most ideal. Additionally, your mental energy did not show any signs of breakthrough ever since you have survived one wind lightning trial back then. What exactly are you planning? Little Martin glanced at Lin Dong before suddenly asking. Little Martin knew only too well about Lin Dong's mental energy talent. Additionally, Lin Dong was in possession of the devouring ancestral symbol. This was like adding wings to a tiger for his mental energy. The thing that was even more surprising was that his mental energy cultivation seemed to have remained stationary ever since Lin Dong endured the last wind lightning trial. In fact, while the second wind lightning trial failed to arrive, his Yuan power cultivation had already broken through to the three Yuan Nirvana stage. Little Martin was not naive enough to believe that Lin Dong's mental energy cultivation did not progress after half a year of training. The reason was likely because Lin Dong had done it on purpose. Ha, have I been discovered? Lin Dong involuntarily smiled when he heard Little Martin's words. His smile also contained a cunningness that was similar to the one Little Martin usually had. However, he did not elaborate. All he did was to smile slightly and said, It is a trick. You will get to know about it soon. Little Martin narrowed his eyes slightly. He thought about it but was temporarily unable to decipher Lin Dong's thoughts. All he could was to shake his head with displeasure. Following which, he turned his head to gaze at the surrounding mountains in the night. He could tell that there were quite a number of groups resting in those mountain peaks. Some experts with shocking strength were amongst them. I think that there will be quite a commotion when Little Flame undergoes a Nirvana tribulation. This place is extremely chaotic and I wonder just how many pairs of eyes are staring here. 
There are four heavenly grade Nirvana seals on our side and they are quite alluring. Currently, the main fighting strength of our group are the three of us and Suro. Now that Little Flame is unable to fight because of his trial, our combined fighting strength is at a weakened state. A flicker flashed within Little Martin's purple-black eyes as his voice was transmitted into Lin Dong's ears. Are you worried that someone will seize this opportunity to attack us? Lin Dong focused his eyes slightly. He had also sensed powerful hidden aura from the surrounding mountains. It would indeed be a troublesome matter if they were to really stir the desire of others. We are not some nameless individuals in the core region. Others will definitely think twice before they attack us. Lin Dong spoke with a soft voice after focusing his eyes. He knew that they were unable to avoid it even if there was trouble. However, regardless of who it was who wanted to step over them, it was likely that the person would have to pay a hefty price. He wanted to see just who would be the first bird that stands out tonight. Mo Ling, So Kui, and the rest clearly understood the current situation. Hence, they immediately became cautious after Little Flame entered cultivation mode. They sat at spots around a hundred feet from where Little Flame sat. Mighty Yuan power suddenly spread. Lin Dong and Little Martin stood at the edge of the mountain top. Their bodies were just like straight long spears. A kind of shocking sharp aura spread apart in this night sky. Suro sat on a green rock behind these two. Her pretty face contained a faint caution. Her long fingers were placed on a wrist. Should any unusual incidents occur, she would undo the seal and fight immediately. Clearly, she also understood that she must take over Little Flame's position as the main fighting strength, while the latter was making a breakthrough. Bang! Suddenly, an incomparably wild and violent Yuan power erupted on the top of the mountain. A shocking hot wave swept apart. Those trees on the mountain peak crumbled into a withered yellow color at that moment. Meanwhile, the original Black Knight coolness was also scattered at this moment. This commotion did not exceed the expectations of Lin Dong's group and it immediately attracted the focus of many practitioners in the surrounding mountains. Immediately, rushing wind sound appeared within the Black Knight. Some figures rushed into midair and looked over at this side from a great distance away. Those gazes were flickering repeatedly in the dark night. Boom! The various different people that had suddenly rushed out were naturally discovered by Lin Dong. His eyes immediately narrowed as he grasped his hand. A black-colored metal seal appeared within it. Black glow permeated the place as a black seal swelled. It became just like a small mountain that was suspended on the mountain top. A shocking energy ripple swept apart. Heavenly Soul Treasure some exclamations immediately erupted when the black-colored metal seal appeared. Their voices were filled with greed but it was also mixed with fear and horror. Those who could arrive at this place were no fools. They naturally understood how powerful a heavenly soul treasure was. At the same time, they clearly understood just what kind of powerful fighting strength someone who controlled a heavenly soul treasure had. Some of the people in the night sky, who were about to act had no choice but to withdraw the greed within their hearts at this moment. Lin Dong's eyes calmly watched this scene. The people in this place were competitors with each other. Hence, he was not worried that they would join forces. No one would be willingly to show one's back to another partner who could backstab one at any moment. It would be the best if they do not attack, Mo Ling sighed in relief and softly said upon seeing this scene. Lin Dong smiled. He was just about to speak when his expression suddenly changed. His eyes were dark and solemn as he looked towards the distant night sky. There was suddenly a shocking fire chi rising from that spot. Finally, the fire chi agglomerated into a white head red feet enormous fierce beast that had the body of an ape. Fearsome beast of the ancient times, Zuyin. Little Martin's eyes gradually turned icy cold as he looked at the enormous ferocious beast and softly said, one of the four great demon sects hui, have they finally come knocking at our door? Lin Dong's face sunk. The black-colored metal seal on the top of his head began to slowly rotate. Chapter 593, Xiao Shan The fire-red flame chi was exceptionally glaring in the night sky. Moreover, 
that faint great wave-like powerful ripple that swept apart also caused countless number of shocking gazes to be thrown over. Is that the fierce beast Zuyin? It is Xiao Shan from the Great Net Empire. He has obtained Zuyin's inheritance, which belongs to one of the four great demon sects. TCH TCH, according to what I know, that four great demon sects and the four great mysterious sects are enemies. Those of them who had obtained the inheritance of the demon sects must use the fresh blood of those who had obtained the inheritance of the mysterious sects in order to obtain the complete inheritance. Looks like they are also charging towards Lin Dong. There is really going to be a good show. It is rumored that Xiao Shan had attempted the fifth Nirvana tribulation. Although he eventually failed, his strength was such that he was unrivaled amongst the four Yuan Nirvana stage practitioners. Although Lin Dong's group defeated the Wind Cloud Empire, they might not be able to gain any advantage in the hands of Xiao Shan. Private conversations swiftly spread within the night sky. This mountain peak had quickly become the most eye-catching spot within this area. That enormous beast, which was formed from a bright red flame, swiftly arrived in front of the numerous surrounding gazes. Finally, it appeared in the air above the mountain peak. Quite a number of rushing wind sound were also transmitted from behind. Finally, numerous figures were suspended in the midair and their auras were all quite powerful. Clearly, they were the powerful individuals from the Great Net Empire. A human figure was standing with his hands behind him, within that fierce beast Zuyin, which was formed from a flame. His faint red eyes indifferently stared at the two figures on the mountain peak below. The fire chi lingered around before entering his figure bit by bit. Only at this moment, was his appearance finally unveiled in front of the many gazes. Xiao Shan was wearing a glaring bright red robes, which was as piercing as fresh blood. Quite a number of people felt a chill within their hearts when they looked at it. Xiao Shan was not considered handsome and his face even possessed a dark red tattoo. At a glance, he looked like a miniature Zuyin. Lin Dong you have finally appeared. Xiao Shan stared at Lin Dong on the mountain peak. His expressionless face was slowly lifted into a smile. His smile pulled at the dark red Zuyin picture and caused his face to be filled with a fierceness. Great Net Empire, Xiao Shan. Lin Dong softly spoke. He knitted his brow slightly as he stared at this unwelcomed guest. Since you are aware of our background, it is likely that you should understand why I have come looking for you. The both of us have no grudge with one another. However, you can only blame yourself for obtaining the inheritance of the four great mysterious sects, Xiao Shan's voice was extremely hoarse. It caused anyone hearing it to feel quite uncomfortable. This kind of ripple, it seems like someone amongst you is experiencing a nirvana tribulation. It seems like I have picked an opportune time. Xiao Shan's eyes were suddenly thrown towards the mountain peak. After which, he saw Little Flame, who had his eyes shut, and laughed. Extremely wild and violent Yuan power surged over the latter. Xiao Shan, I do not wish to become enemies with your great net empire. Therefore, you should keep yourself in check. If you remain obstinate, it will be too late for regrets when you lose your Nirvana seal. Lin Dong's eyes turned slightly cold as he slowly said. Ha ha, regret. Xiao Shan laughed out loud towards the sky in midair. His laughter was filled with a ridicule. Lin Dong, I know that your group had defeated the Wind Cloud Empire. However, someone at Feng Kang's level is merely ordinary in my eyes. I'm afraid that you are a little naive to attempt to raise your stature in front of me by using this matter. Those experts from the Great Net Empire behind Xiao Shan also released some mocking laughter. Their eyes playfully stared at Lin Dong's group. In that case, it is pointless to speak anything more. Let's fight. Lin Dong's eyes were slightly lowered. He clenched his hand and the black-colored metal seal in his hand suddenly rotated. Black glow permeated the place while the black dragon crouching above the seal appeared to show signs of awakening. The teasing expression in the eyes of the experts from the Great Net Empire began to withdraw upon seeing that suspending black-colored metal seal. Clearly, they also sensed the might of this heavenly soul treasure. 
Xiao Shan's eyes narrowed as he stared at the black metal seal. Immediately, he waved his bright red robes and took a stride forward. He laughed coldly, I have heard many rumors about you Lin Dong. Today, I wish to personally try and see if you, a person who had climbed up from a low-rank empire, is really that troublesome to deal with. If you want me to surrender, you should prove it with your abilities. Xiao Shan's body trembled suddenly. Monstrous bright red fire chi swept out. It appeared as though the temperature of the surroundings had been raised. A manic-like feeling lingered around him, causing him to appear exceptionally shocking. Little Martin's purple-black eyes stared at the shocking aura of Xiao Shan. A cold glint flashed across his eyes. However, Lin Dong extended his hand to stop the former just as he was about to step forward. Little Flame is in the midst of breaking through and must not be disturbed. It is much safer if you are standing guard. Lin Dong softly said. Other than Xiao Shan, there were three others from the Great Net Empire who had reached the level of four Yuan Nirvana stage. This was quite a powerful lineup. If they were to intervene and disturb Little Flame's attempt at undergoing the tribulation, it was likely that things would become quite troublesome. Moreover, the one most suitable amongst them who could perfectly protect Little Flame in the face of their attacks, was likely Little Martin. Although that fellow has not advanced to the Five Yuan Nirvana stage, he is stronger than Feng Kang, who was at the peak of the Four Yuan Nirvana stage. Can you handle him alone? Little Martin hesitated for a moment and asked. Lin Dong smiled. Xiao Shan was indeed quite strong and he was on a different level compared to Feng Kang. However, the current Lin Dong was also much stronger when compared to when he exchanged blows with Feng Kang. Protect Little Flame well. Lin Dong softly instructed. After which, he ceased uttering any other unnecessary words. His body moved and rushed towards the midair under the attention of countless number of gazes. Following which, they turned their attention towards that black metal seal. Good, you have guts. Xiao Shan involuntarily laughed coldly when he saw that Lin Dong dared to meet him in battle alone. He grabbed abruptly with his hand before a fiery hot wild and violent Yuan power agglomerated in his palm with lightning-like speed. After which, it transformed into a five feet bright red blade. Following which, that blade shook and emitted a cling sound. Even the air was slashed apart. Lin Dong, other people have said that you are one of the few people within this hundred empire war who is able to challenge a super empire with your status as someone from a low rank empire. Next, I shall witness just whether you live up to your reputation. Xiao Shan's eyes suddenly turned sharp and cold. The crimson red large blade in his hand furiously slashed downwards. Dozens of enormous fiery red blade glow erupted with lightning like speed. The blade glow flashed past and actually sealed off Lin Dong's retreat path. Lin Dong clenched his fist as he looked at those fiery red blade glow that rushed over. His heavenly crocodile bone spear appeared with a flash. That spear shook, forming numerous sharp spear after images which struck heavily against those blade glows. Clang clang clang. Sparks shot in all directions. Wild and violent Yuan power whizzed and spread. Many of those wild and violent blade glows were completely broken by Lin Dong's spear after images. I don't have the mood to play with you. You should not use these kind of probing attacks. Dragon Sonic Web Lin Dong's eyes turned slightly chilly. The seal formed by his hands changed and the black dragon under his feet immediately let out a roar towards the sky. That black dragon on the seal slowly opened its dragon's eyes and widened his mouth. Black light crazily gathered. After which, it transformed into a black-colored sonic wave amidst the soul-stirring dragon roar and swept out in all directions. These black-colored sonic wave did not rush out in all directions like it did in the past after it swept out. Instead, it gathered together and formed an incomparably large black-colored sonic web that immediately covered Xiao Shan within it. Clearly, after Lin Dong grew increasingly familiar with this black dragon sky roaring seal, his control over it was also becoming increasingly proficient. Some shallow scars was cut and formed in the space when the black-colored sonic wave rushed past. 
Xiao Shan's eyes congelated when he saw this situation. He commented with a deep voice, You are skilled indeed. You are right, I also do not have the patience to continue playing with you. Since you are one of the inheritors of the four great mysterious sects, I shall allow you to witness what is called the inheritance of the four great demon sect. Just watch me finish you off with one attack. Zuin Demon Spirit Xiao Shan widened both of his arms. His body trembled violently as a majestic bright red aura suddenly began to gush out from his chest like a volcano. Finally, it agglomerated in a wild manner. Under the numerous stunned gazes, it actually transformed into a thousand feet large crimson beast. The enormous beast had an ape's body with copper red feet. Its head was as smooth and eye-catching as white jade. This was the body of the ancient fierce beast Zuin and it was different from the kind of illusionary figure before. The body of this Zuin actually possessed a peerless fierce aura with a wildness that permeated within it. At a glance, it was as though it had traveled through space and time from the ancient era. Wail! The large beast howled to the sky. Fierce aura spread throughout the sky. A mountain peak-like large claw was suddenly extended out and it actually forcefully shattered that sonic wave web with just a fist. After which, a large hand that carried a huge shadow tore through the empty space. It contained a destructive strength within it as it violently slammed towards Lin Dong in front of the countless number of shocked eyes. Given that momentum, even a 4 Yuan Nirvana stage expert would definitely not live if he was struck by it. Sir Ro on the mountain top, was also so frightened, till she covered her mouth in shock due to Xiao Shan's attack. Her large eyes were filled with panic and worry. Little Martin narrowed his eyes slightly. Although he still appeared calm on the surface, some purple-black glow was already agglomerating over the tip of his finger. Roar! An enormous shadow whizzed over and an earth-shaking dragon roar once again resounded over the sky. The black dragon on the black metal seal swelled. Finally, it rose to the air. A dense pressure was also being emitted at this moment. Let's see whose attack will finish off the other party. A fierce glint was similarly surging in Lin Dong's eyes. He looked at the black dragon that flew out from the black-colored metal seal. A kind of green light suddenly spread over both of his hands. After which, it was ruthlessly inserted into the body of the black dragon. At the same time, a little of the cluster of dragon aura within his body was split apart and poured into the body of the black dragon. You are merely an ordinary member of the dragon race when you are alive. Now, I shall bestow you with heavenly dragon aura. Show me all of your might. Lin Dong watched that black dragon, which was wildly struggling after having suddenly emitted a bright green glow. A fiery heat surged up his eyes. He really wanted to try and see just what kind of powerful strength it would have after obtaining the might of his heavenly dragon aura. Chapter 594, Dragon Soul Battling Zuin Roar A deafening dragon roar suddenly resounded over the night sky. Sound waves, that were visible to the naked eye, spread over the night sky while being accompanied by an intense pressure. Quite a number of experts felt their skin turn numb wherever the sound wave passed. Immediately, their eyes became much more solemn. They had sensed quite a wild and violent energy ripple from within that sonic wave. Countless number of eyes were instantly focused onto a spot. One could see that the originally rising large black dragon had actually began to struggle crazily at this moment. While it struggled, a kind of deep green glow began to be emitted from under its black scales. Following which, that peculiar green glow spread across the black dragon's entire body at an alarming rate. The green light spread and the originally black-colored dragon scales of the black dragon actually faintly turned a pale green color, while the entire dragon body began to swell. Green light lingered over its huge dragon claws. It was as it could easily shatter an entire mountain with just a slam of its claw. The heavenly dragon aura was a unique energy that only a relatively high rank member of the dragon tribe possessed. Although the black dragon was also considered part of the dragon tribe, it was clearly far from this level when it was alive. Now that Lin Dong had poured the heavenly dragon aura into it, this was undoubtedly providing a divine aid to that dragon soul. 
the black dragon currently transformed into a quiet green color due to the mixture of the green light. Its icy cold large body slowly meandered. It was as though it had a metallic body that was emitted an old and hearty feeling. The dragon soul within the heavenly soul treasure Hui. Xiao Shan stared at the dragon soul that had formed in the sky from within the enormous body of Zuyin. A grave expression flashed across his eyes. Lin Dong's strength might only be that of a three Yuan Nirvana stage, but his fighting abilities caused even him to experience some palpitations within his heart. No wonder he was able to defeat Feng Kang's group. Although it was a dragon soul, it was merely the soul of an ordinary member of the dragon tribe. Humph, this fierce beast Zuyin of mine contains some of the original Zuyin aura. In the ancient era, the fierce beast Zuyin will kill members of the dragon tribe without hesitation. Brat, surrender your nirvana seal. Xiao Shan laughed coldly. The enormous Zuyin's body outside extended its large hand explosively. The hand appeared as though it was chasing the stars and the moon as it grabbed towards that dragon soul. Wherever the large hand passed, even the air itself began to emit a bang as it exploded. Although the reputation of the fierce beast Zuyin is quite strong, all you possess is its form. I'm afraid that you do not have the ability to snatch my nirvana seal. A coldness surged within Lin Dong's eyes. He looked at the dragon soul, which fierceness had suddenly soared at this instant. His eyes suddenly turned sharp. He waved his hand down, before the enormous dragon tail broke through the air with a swing. Meanwhile, its large quiet green dragon claw carried an enormously great energy that seemed to be able to split the world, as it ferociously clashed with the fierce beast Zunyan, that was charging over in front of the countless number of eyes. Boom! In the night sky, two enormous beasts violently collided before an incomparably fierce violent energy ripple swept downwards. At that instant, a loud sound that one could describe sounded out. It shook the eardrums of quite a number of people until their ears hurt. Boom boom boom! The quiet green dragon entrenched itself while the fierce beast Zuyin roared. These two large beasts collided with a shockingly crazy speed under the night sky. Their claws furiously smashed around as waves after waves of shocking energy ripple began to crazily sweep apart in the sky. Some of the surrounding mountain peaks also began to collapse under the cover of that ripple. Many experts in the night sky looked at the two enormous beings rampantly colliding with each other. Their faces were incomparably solemn. They could sense that each of the attacks by both the Dragon Soul and the Fierce Beast Zuyin could force a 4 Yuan Nirvana stage expert into quite a miserable state. As these blows began to sweep apart, it was likely that there was hardly anyone here who could block all of them. Lin Dong really lives up to his reputation. He is actually able to fight with Xiao Shan in such a manner. Some people involuntarily let out a murmur on top of having a grave face. It was fortunate that they did not directly lose their reasoning because of greed previously. Otherwise, if they were the ones who were currently fighting with Lin Dong, it was likely that just one slam from the Dragon Soul would likely seriously injure a majority of three Yuan Nirvana stage experts. Bang! Another incomparably fierce collision occurred in the sky. The dragon soul and the soul of Zuyin were shaken until they were pushed back for over a thousand feet. The momentum was unusually shocking. This fellow, Xiao Shan, whose actual body was hidden within the body of Zuyin, felt a incomparably fierce and violent strength. He involuntarily clenched his teeth. In this battle with Lin Dong, Xiao Shan did not hold back at all. Summoning the demonic spirit of Zuyin was one of his powerful killing moves. However, he had never expected that even this move failed to do anything to Lin Dong. My strength is more than just one level stronger than you. I want to see just how long you can endure. Xiao Shan's seal technique changed as a cold glint flashed across his eyes. An increasingly stronger Yuan power swiftly swept out from his body. Immediately, Zuyin's body began to swell. Humph! When he saw Xiao Shan relentlessly pestering him, Lin Dong clearly felt a little irritated. He let out a cold snort and waved his hand. That black dragon sky roaring seal suddenly whizzed over. After which, it became just like a small mountain. 
its dark black color emitted a shockingly heavy feeling. Heavenly Dragon Seal Lin Dong's expression was solemn. His hand seals directly changed and the quiet green dragon soul suddenly roared towards the sky. It transformed into a majestic green light that completely surged into that enormous black metal seal. Following the pouring in of such a mighty energy, the quiet green light began to flash over that metal seal. Finally, it vaguely transformed into an enormous crouching dragon figure. Bam! That black metal seal shook intensely. Finally, it suddenly came slamming down furiously. It was just like a mountain that was suspended in the sky as it violently smashed onto Zuin's enormous body. Clang! The stunning loud sound reverberated over the place as that frightening strength, which permeated from the black-colored seal, actually forced that demonic Zuin soul back for a couple of thousand feet. Numerous arm-sized thick crack lines began to appear on the latter's enormous body. Lin Dong's fatal attack had directly shattered the body of the demonic Zuyin soul. The might that was unleashed when the heavenly soul treasure collaborated with the heavenly dragon aura was actually this frightening. Crack. The crack lines on the demonic soul began to swiftly spread in front of the many shocked eyes. Finally, it emitted a boom and completely fell apart. A wave swept apart and the forest below was forcefully turned into flat land. The explosion of the demonic soul also resulted in a figure shooting backwards in a somewhat miserable manner. His toes continued to press on the air and the air behind him continued to explode because of the frightening strength that seeped out from within his body. That figure flew for a total of a thousand feet in distance before finally stabilizing himself in a miserable manner in front of the many gazes. Immediately, that figure raised his head, revealing an ugly face. He was Xiao Shan. Chief. Those experts from the Great Net Empire had a drastic change in their expressions when they saw this scene. Clearly, they did not expect that this incomparably powerful Xiao Shan to be forced into such a miserable state in a battle with Lin Dong. Attack. Capture the rest. Xiao Shan's eyes became fierce and ruthless as he cried out in a stern voice. After this battle, he had already understood just how strong Lin Dong was. Naturally, he was unwilling to fight alone. Their great net empire had many people and it was likely that they would be able to gain the upper hand if they attacked together. Yes sir. A fierce glow also flashed in the eyes of those experts from the great net empire after hearing Xiao Shan's cries. They immediately rushed out and attacked Little Martin's group on the mountain peak. All of you should not move. Little Martin's eyes turned slightly cold as he looked at the experts from the Great Net Empire swarming over. He let out a cold cry before flicking his ten fingers. Purple-black glow directly transformed into ten purple-black chains that erupted out. It appeared as though it was a layer of dragonite, trapping all of the experts from the Great Net Empire. Boom boom. Those experts from the Great Net Empire attacked one after another when they were blocked by Little Martin. Powerful martial art attacks smashed onto the layers of Dragonite. However, the thing that caused them to be slightly shocked was that even if they were to join forces, they were still unable to break that layer of defense. Immediately, their hearts turned cold. They looked at the distant handsome man with icy cold eyes and began to vaguely feel an uneasiness. So many of you, yet all of you are actually unable to break his defense. What are all of you doing? Xiao Shan similarly felt that things were not quite right while he cried out furiously. He seemed to have underestimated the strength of Lin Dong's group. Damn it! If I have known earlier, I would have called the Blood Seal Empire over. Xiao Shan clenched his teeth. The Blood Seal Empire, which he spoke of, was naturally another empire that had obtained one of the four great demon sects' inheritance. It is likely going to be difficult to succeed today. Looks like I need to beat a retreat first. Xiao Shan's eyes flashed and he actually had some intention to withdraw. However, this thought had just formed in his heart when a shocking wind strangely appeared above his head. Immediately, he hurriedly raised his head, only to see Lin Dong's emotionless face. I have given you a chance. Yet, you continue to press your luck. In that case, you should not blame me for showing no mercy. 
killing intent surged within Lin Dong's eyes. Clearly, he had been angered by Xiao Shan's actions. He extended his hand and a green light surged uncontrollably. One could see layers after layers of green scales swiftly appeared on his hand. After which, his hand swelled and his entire hand had actually transformed into a green-colored dragon claw. In the past, Lin Dong was merely able to transform into a dragon finger. However, after experiencing the big battle from the last time, Lin Dong's mastery of the Green Heaven materialized dragon skill had clearly improved tremendously. Currently, he was able to transform his hand into a dragon claw. Green Dragon Palm, Shattering Soul The dragon palm whistled as it rushed down. That green light was torn into nothingness. Immediately, Xiao Shan could only look at it flash by with a shocked expression. After which, it carried an incomparably fierce aura as that enormous dragon claw ruthlessly landed on his body. Bang! A frightening strength was discharged and Xiao Shan immediately spat out a mouthful of fresh blood. Lin Dong grabbed Xiao Shan's hand just when the latter was falling. Amidst his furious eyes, Lin Dong completely absorbed the shiny golden heavenly nirvana seal on the latter's hand. Ha, such a forceful heavenly nirvana seal. Looks like you have absorbed the seal of quite a number of people. However, I have ended up benefiting from it. Lin Dong looked at his own palm that gradually had an additional trace of purple gold color after absorbing the nirvana seal of Xiao Shan. A strange smile involuntarily appeared on Lin Dong's face. Chapter 595, Domination Lin Dong Xiao Shan's body fell miserably from the night sky. His aura was weary but his face was filled with an extremely furious expression. His nirvana seal had only reached this level that was close to the nirvana golden ranking, after he had expended a great amount of effort and various tactics to absorb 10 4 Yuan nirvana stage experts nirvana seals. However, Lin Dong had currently snatched it all away. This caused all of his effort to completely vanish. Quite a number of experts in the surrounding night sky looked at each other. They had never expected that Xiao Shan would actually be defeated by Lin Dong. In fact, even the former's Nirvana seal was snatched away by the latter. Lin Dong, the both, the both of us are now sworn enemies. Xiao Shan's body violently smashed onto the ground. That massive momentum caused him to spit out another mouthful of fresh blood. However, he ignored his injuries as he raised his head and roared out furiously. You reap what you sow. Lin Dong's laughed in a chilling manner. If he was to be defeated by Xiao Shan today, it was likely that not only would his Nirvana seal be stolen, but he would definitely use his fresh blood to complete the inheritance of the Zuyan sect. The victor was the king and the loser was nothing more than a bandit. Lin Dong had seen quite a number of such events within this ancient battlefield during this one year. Currently, Xiao Shan was already seriously injured and was not a threat. However, Lin Dong did not show any signs of attacking again. Instead, his attention was directed towards Little Flame on the mountain top, who was undergoing a Nirvana tribulation. At this moment, the wild and violent Yuan power that had surrounded Little Flame's body had become substance like. A wild violence spread and the ground within a thousand feet had directly cracked apart because of dryness. All the surrounding trees turned withering yellow before they transformed into powder and scattered. M. O. Ling and the others, who were originally seated around Little Flame to protect him, were eventually forced to move away because they were unable to endure that kind of wild and violent heat. They circulated their Yuan power and blocked themselves from the erosion of that special hot Yuan power. The fourth Nirvana Tribulation was not considered weak. However, it clearly did not possess any fatal threat towards Little Flame. His body was so strong that even the golden body of those four Yuan Nirvana stage experts were unable to match up. Hence, as long as no accident occurred during the Nirvana Tribulation, it was likely that Little Flame would have more than 70% chance of successfully enduring through it. His odds of success was definitely a level that most of the experts could not hope to attain. Have the experts from the Great Net Empire also been blocked? Lin Dong's eyes turned towards the space above the mountain top. All he could see was a dragnet that was formed by flickering purple-black chains. 
Those experts from the Great Net Empire were also a little startled when they saw this scene. After all, there were at least a couple of dozens of men from the Great Net Empire. Amongst them were three experts who had stepped into the Four Yuan Nirvana stage. Even so, they were still unable to break the barrier that Little Martin had created. Such terrifying strength! Quite a number of people in the surrounding night sky looked at those people from the Great Net Empire, who had gone all out but still failed to approach that mountain peak. After which, they turned to look at the handsome young man, who was standing with his hands behind his back in midair. Traces of shock began to surge up their faces. Easily blocking three four Yuan Nirvana stage experts and dozens of other strong experts alone. This feat was likely something that only those peak experts who had stepped into the five Yuan Nirvana stage were able to accomplish. However, this exceptionally handsome young man had actually done it. Could it be that this fellow had also stepped into the five Yuan Nirvana stage? Quite a number of people felt cold sweat dripping all over their bodies when they thought of this. They looked at each other and there was a shock that they could not hide within their eyes. 5 Yuan Nirvana Stage There were definitely people currently in this core region who had reached this level. However, those who could reach this level were all, without exception top existences even amongst the super empires. These people were basically demonic-like existences who were able to comfortably enter the Nirvana Golden Ranking and catch the eyes of the super sex. However, this so-called low-rank empire actually had such a monster as well? The Great Yan Empire, why is it so strong? Quite a number of people were speechless. They were simply unable to imagine how a low-rank empire was able to produce so many monster-level beings all at once. Originally, they had thought that Lin Dong was already the most outstanding person within the Great Yan Empire. However, now that they had taken a closer look, they finally realized that there was another one, who had hidden himself. With this lineup, it was likely that they would not lose out even if they were to fight against those elite individuals from the super empires. Lin Dong's body was suspended in front of the mountain peak, while all the gazes in the sky was quietly filled with shock. His hand was holding the heavenly crocodile bone spear. That sharp icy coldness in his eyes swept all around him. He was aware that this big battle had definitely attracted quite a number of experts who were observing this spot. Currently, Little Flame was at a critical juncture as he was undergoing a Nirvana tribulation and the consequences of him being disturbed was severe. Therefore, even though he defeated Xiao Shan, he did not chase after him. This was because he clearly understood what was more important. A sharp and stern aura spread out from within Lin Dong's body. It appeared to be just like a sharp sword that cut through the night sky. His blade-like eyes swept around but hardly anyone dared to look at him. After witnessing the shocking fighting strength that Lin Dong had unleashed earlier as well as the terrifying strength which Little Martin had displayed, none of them dared to attack regardless of how much they coveted their Nirvana seals and heavenly soul treasure. Boom boom! While Lin Dong was looking around him and deterring everyone, the experts from the Great Net Empire were sent flying miserably by the purple black chain dragnet. The Nirvana seals within their hands were all snatched by Little Martin when they flew away. Within just a short few minutes, the interior of the dragnet only had three four Yuan Nirvana stage experts bitterly enduring within it. The remaining people were all defeated by Little Martin alone. At this moment, Xiao Shan once again rushed into the midair with a swaying body. However, his aura was already quite sluggish. Clearly, he had sustained pretty severe injuries from Lin Dong earlier. His somewhat pale white face turned unusually green when he saw that the Great Net Empire had suffered such a terrible loss. However, he did not dare to attack again. He was aware that with his current condition, it was impossible for him to match up to Lin Dong. The end result would be the same even if he was to forcefully charge forward again. Boom boom boom. Three extremely low and deep sound were emitted in the midair. After which, everyone saw three purple black chains being swiftly flung onto the bodies of the three great net empire experts with lightning like speed, appearing just like poisonous snake coming out of hiding. Terrifying force surged out and directly slammed at the three of them until they spat out blood and flew backwards. At the same time, 
the Nirvana seals in their hands were also unceremoniously snatched away by Little Martin. The three figures were eventually miserably caught by the people from the Great Net Empire. Only at this moment did the purple-black chain in Little Martin's hands faded. His gaze gently swept around and a frightening hostility vaguely flashed across his handsome face. Regardless of how calm and indifferent Little Martin usually acted, he ultimately possessed the heart of a celestial demon Martin. According to his character, it was likely that he would have already eaten all of these people. However, he worried that he would bring trouble to Lin Dong if he was to reveal his identity. That explains why he chose to put in the extra amount of effort. Who else wants to target us? Little Martin swept his slightly cold eyes over the Great Net Empire in a deterring demeanor. He slowly looked towards the surrounding night sky. A dark cold voice spread around him. The expressions of quite a number of people changed after his voice spread out. However, no one dared to reply. Even a group as powerful as the Great Net Empire was miserably defeated by Lin Dong's group. Hence, they did not wish to offend such ruthless characters. The peak was completely silent. Mo Ling's group on the mountain peak involuntarily extended their hands and violently rubbed their faces. They immediately let out a bitter laughter. They could not imagine that just Lin Dong and Little Martin alone, were actually able to deter the geniuses from various empires to the point that they did not even dare to utter anything. These two abnormal beings. Lin Dong quietly stood on top of his black-colored metal seal. He watched this quiet night sky and his expression relaxed a little. It seemed like after using the Great Net Empire to set an example, no one dared to step forward. Hey! This thought had just flashed across Lin Dong's heart when he suddenly raised his head. There was a mountain at that spot. A green-clad figure flashed and appeared. At the same time, an incomparably sinister pair of eyes were locked onto Lin Dong like a evil ghost. Moonlight scattered down from the sky and shone onto the somewhat distorted face, which appeared just like a ghost. That appearance was quite a shocking one. Lin Dong's eyes shrunk slightly as he looked at that figure. His hand, which was holding the heavenly crocodile bone spear, slowly tightened. An icy cold voice seeped out from between his teeth and spread apart with a killing intent that was difficult to suppress. Lin Langtian, you are still alive.